In Sioux Falls and the surrounding communities, there are hundreds of animals living in shelters and in foster homes who are looking for their forever homes. We want to introduce you to some of these sweet, adoptable animals. So today, we're joined by the Sioux Empire Pit Rescue, who are going to tell us a little bit more about Cinnamon. Hi, Hi, thank you so much thank for, you for having us. Can you tell us about this sweet, sweet yes. cinnamon right here? <laughs> so cinnamon is about seven years old. Um, she is a lovely, lovely lady. Uh, recently had uh, two knee replacements done. Uh, so she had a double ACL surgery. Um, she's fully recovered and ready to play and um, hike and do whatever a family might require. Um, she lives with other dogs currently. Um, and yeah, she's just a sweet kind of chill. We'll, we'll call her elderly in the dog world, yes. but for the, for the yes. most part, she's still very spry and very, uh, has a good amount of energy to do whatever you, you think you want to go do with her. It seems she got a lot of energy when the treats came out. Yes. She was ready. You said treat and her ears popped right and up. And she knows exactly where they're at too. <laughs> yeah. so. Sit. Oh, good, good girl. Can you tell us a little bit about um, what you would imagine as the ideal home for a dog like Cinnamon? You know, the great thing about a lot of our dogs is that they do well in many different kinds of homes. Um, we have dogs that would be great with a family with kids or with other dogs. Um, we have dogs who, you know, might want to be that solitary dog who uh, just, uh, you know, hangs out in the home on the couch. Cinnamon is a good example of a dog. She loves car rides. Yes. So if you're someone who likes to travel, she might be a good companion for you. Um, yeah, she's just an all-around all good girl. And can you tell us how long um, Cinnamon has been in your guys' care, um, care? Yeah, well, we haven't had Cinnamon for a terribly um, long amount of time. Most of our dogs are with us for anywhere from, you know, a couple months to a couple years. Mm -hmm. um, and she's kind of in that, that middle of the road. Um, she is, yeah, she came to us... Um, from just south from Iowa. Uh, we normally take dogs from like the Georgia region, mm -hmm. um, areas where there's high um, population of abandoned dogs or surrender dogs um, where they might, you know, rather than having them live in a, a cinder block kennel, mm -hmm. um, we would rather have them in our homes, on our couches, getting loves and just like cinnamon. She, she loves the uh, personal attention. Yes, she, you can tell she, she's ready to snuggle and play and, and get all the treats. She's she clocked can. everyone in this studio yeah. and she's yeah. ready for pets. She, <laughs> she's ready. Well, can you tell us, I think there is um, a very common misconception mm -hmm. that uh, pit bulls cannot be family dogs, that pit mixes can't be family dogs, yeah. that they're aggressive. Cinnamon is obviously <laughs> not that dog. Can you tell us a little bit about that? You know, the thing about, you know, pit bulls or any, um, what we would consider a bully breed is that, I mean, they do have a demeanor that um, can come off a little bit, uh, you know, they're, they're blocky and they're strong, um, but they're also tenacious, they're terriers, so they're um, got a lot of uh, fun characteristics and silly personality, and um, I personally have had pit bulls for over 17 years, and I have two children who were raised with at least two if not more plus all our foster dogs so um, I think they're a great family dog especially if you um, you know like to be outdoors or, or do any sort of um, fun activity but then if you also like to snuggle on the couch and watch a movie pit bulls are uh, great couch potatoes in fact we have a dog right now in the in the foster program whose name is potato wonderful <laughs> well if somebody is seeing this maybe even me <laughs> um, and is so interested in bringing cinnamon into their home how can they do so so we have more information available about all of our dogs their bios um, at pitrescue.org um, if you go pitrescue.org forward slash cinnamon you can find everything about her there as well um, you can also sponsor dogs if you're not someone who's ready to adopt um, each of our dogs needs a sponsor on the page you can find out ways to volunteer um, contribute to our foster program everything like that so lots of good info there at pitrescue.org awesome and we'll have that link as well on our dakota news now website so you can learn a little bit more about cinnamon and maybe bring her to your home yeah thank you so much thank you uh, we'll be back right after the break